Hi, so in this video, we're going to be talking about Stellar Phoenix window data recovery. We did the Mac version, so they sent me the Windows version. Let's take a look. Select what you want to recover. Everything, documents, folder, emails, multimedia. I want to select everything. Click Next. We're going to look for the F drive. You have the capability of doing a deep scan. For this video, we're not going to do that. Also, if you can't find a partition, click this option here. It's going to allow you to see deleted partitions, stuff like that. But for this video, we're not going to do that. Scan. Scanning completed successfully. So over here, we got the GoPro folder. We're going to select everything. I'm going to turn preview off. You have the capability of leaving that on. I'm going to recover everything in here. I'm going to create a folder and I'm going to call it GoPro. Now I'm going to start saving. Might take some time. So the recovery was successful. And if you didn't get the results that you were looking for, we can click this deep scan. Now this is going to take a while. If you deleted a file, make sure you stop using that drive. The minute you write over the file, you lost the file forever. I was able to recover some footage from a GoPro. Now the truth is some of those files were corrupted. I've used that chip so many times that I wrote over some of the files. So now let me show you a real example. So if we go to this computer, we're going to take a look at the G drive. There's nothing in here. Let's do a scan, see what we find. So we're going to click the G drive, scan. Press OK. And over here you have file types, tree view, and deleted list. As you can see, we got two files here. We have a JPEG, and then we have a shortcut. We don't really need the shortcut, but we need this picture here. So let's save this photo. So I'm going to recover, I'm going to browse, I'm going to select the destination, start saving. Hopefully that worked. So let's go look for that folder, root, check it out. How awesome is that? And if we go to the actual drive itself, which is the G drive, there's nothing else here. There's a picture here, but it's not the one we're looking for. Earlier I mentioned that we had the capability of finding lost partitions. So let's just take a look at that. So we're going to click that scan. Now, depending on the type of hard drive, this might actually take some time. We're not going to do that in this video, but I'll give you an example. I'm going to select the first drive search and it's actually searching for the drive. And there you go. It found all the partitions. So you're going to select the partition deep scan. It's going to take some time. Once it comes back, hopefully you should have your data. First one, it's going to be advanced settings. So you have preview corrupt photos and safe mode. Turn preview on, turn preview off, resume recovery. The next option updates. This other option here, export license. If I want to use this on another machine, I'm able to export the license. Really simple. This program requires you to activate it online. There's no offline activation. And the next option is just to help. So if you are looking for something specific, some facts, check this out. So up here you have some of the same options. So you have resume recovery. You also have this, which I think is pretty neat. Let's say you need some professional help. You can actually call these people. And if you need an expert, they'll definitely help you out. Next, about, help, buy online, and register. So if this is the first time watching one of my videos, subscribe to the channel, hit the thumbs up, check the description, press the bell for future notifications. This is Ray, and I'm out of here. Later, guys.